Hi, I'm Logan from Hidden Villa. And what I'm in front of right now just isn't a random pile of bark and sticks. There's an animal that actually built this. This is one of the most amazing houses that you can find in the woods. The animal that built this is about this long from the tip of its nose to its tail. And it's, it's an animal called a wood rat. And they build huge houses. Some houses are eight feet tall and they do it only with their little hands and giant rodent-like teeth. And they clip bark or clip uh, branches and pile them all together and they just do amazing things. I consider them the engineers of the forest. So some animals, they live in trees, some animals dig holes, but wood rats, they build. If you think about your house that you have at home, you probably have a place in your house where you eat your food or make your food in your kitchen. You probably have a place where you go to the bathroom. You probably have a, a place where you sleep and you have ways to get in and out. And if it gets too hot, you can probably cool your house down. And if it gets too cold, you can heat your house up. And we think that we're pretty special as humans that we can do all this great stuff in our houses. But wood rats can do the same thing. There are so many tunnels in and out of here. It's probably six or seven different entrances and exits. They can sneak out if a coyote or a rattlesnake was trying to get in. Also, they have separate rooms for storing food. And some of the food isn't good when they pick it. So they have to let it season and age, and then they can eat it a few months later. So they have pantries and kitchens. They also have uh, bathrooms where they go to the bathroom in the same spot. In fact, I think I'm kneeling in it right now. And uh, they, um, they even have, if, you were, if we were to open the lid off this, we would find one little room in the middle and would have a little soft ball of grasses like this. And that would be the animal sleeping quarters, its mattress. And also, because there's so many sticks and uh, bark on top of it, that it keeps the animal cool in the summer. It can be 90 degrees outside and be nice and cool and 60 degrees on the inside here. Or if it was rainy and cold and just barely above freezing, it would be nice and toasty on the inside. So wood rats are really amazing engineers and they do it all with just their hands and their teeth. And so they're some of my favorite animals in the woods. And so if you're looking through and hiking, you can find huge amounts of wood rat nests. And you can take a moment and think how amazing these animals are. So the next time you're in the woods and you see a pile of sticks, pay attention because it might not just be a pile of sticks. It could be an amazing wood rat house. From Hidden Villa, I'm Logan, and that's what's good in the woods. Mm -hmm.